Netizens discuss Blackpink Lisa's new music. It was with Rockstar that Blackpink member Lisa made her highly anticipated comeback, attracting worldwide attention with her bold style and passion. This is her first song since launching her own label, El Oud. Released on June 28, 2024, the music video for Rockstar became the fastest K-pop video of the year to reach 2 million views on YouTube, breaking the record previously held by Baby Monster's Sheesh, who took 1 hour and 23 minutes to reach the same views. The song, a captivating hip-hop track, highlights Lisa's impressive rapping abilities. It boasts powerful beats and rapid-fire rap lines that radiate confidence and sass. The music video, filmed in Bangkok, showcases Lisa's Thai heritage and features elements of Thai culture and everyday life, along with her dynamic choreography. The release garnered mixed reactions from fans. While some applauded her evolution into a global pop star, others believed it strayed too far from her Blackpink persona. Comments like, It's overrated if you ask me. It feels awkward. It doesn't really have the wow factor compared to her past solo releases and the sound isn't the best seriously, were common. Chart performance has been underwhelming too. Upon its release, Rockstar achieved eighth place on Spotify's daily top songs global chart and reached the top spot in Thailand. However, it landed at 29th in Korea, 14th in the Philippines and Hong Kong, 10th in Taiwan, and 9th in Malaysia and Singapore. In Indonesia, however, it ranked significantly lower at 79th place. On iTunes, it reached number one only in Thailand and failed to enter the top 100 on Korea's Melon chart. This is in stark contrast to La Lisa, which topped the iTunes charts in 72 countries. According to Sports Seoul, Korean netizens are dissatisfied that Lisa is focusing more on her Thai roots rather than promoting in South Korea, where she has lived for more than half of her life. Lisa passed the YG Entertainment Thailand audition in 2010 and came to Korea in 2011 at the age of 14 to train as a trainee for five years and three months. After working at Blackpink for seven years, they established themselves as the world's top girl group. She spent more than half of her life living in Korea. Despite the negative criticism, some music critics argue that there is potential for a comeback, citing that money also didn't immediately gain popularity upon its release. So what do you think of the situation? Leave a comment and don't forget to subscribe. See you in the next video.